A few weeks ago, Thomas Dilworth was looking forward to his sixth season as the Big Sandy boys basketball coach. He says he was put on paid administrative leave after a team meeting he held between him and the players. Dilworth said he has struggled with mental health the last several years, exacerbated by PTSD and a custody issue involving his daughter, and wanted to share his perspective with his team. I felt overwhelmingly compelled that I needed to kind of share what I had been going through the last two years with the boys, um, and I did. We have reached out to Big Sandy Superintendent Dan Schrock on several occasions looking for further comment. He said Dilworth was put on paid administrative leave for the remainder of the season due to a personal reason and could not provide additional comment. Well, and if you would have asked me had I ever thought this would happen in this community, I would say no. Like, I, I mean, there's a lot of good people here. Dilworth said he thinks this is sending the wrong message about mental health to the community and added that it's not about getting his job back anymore. My biggest concern is the message that has been sent to the kids about if you talk about mental health, there's going to be a bad consequence. He and his wife Heather said the last several weeks have been hectic but supportive. People have been very supportive of him for the last five years. I was the cheer advisor and I specifically did cheer because he was a coach and I was going to all the games and I had to let them know that I wasn't going to do cheer anymore because like if you guys can't even support my husband as a coach and and with his mental health why would i want to work here too dilworth made a post on facebook which inspired other people to share with him their stories about mental health i explained to them very descriptively how it took everything out of me to just get up and and try to move forward each day i i talked about having to uh give up driving for a certain period of time because all I could think about was which power pole I wanted to put my, my vehicle into. They've gotten dozens of messages from community members as well as people they don't know. He says he wants this situation to help inspire people to come forward and wants to start more conversations about mental health in a proactive way. I got into coaching because I want to have a change, an impact on kids, a positive impact. The responsibility of a coach, any coach that's worth their salt, is going to be teaching them skills that are going to help them be successful in life. For now, Dilworth is exploring other coaching opportunities as the situation is ongoing. In Big Sandy, Asher Lined, MTN News.